it gives me great pleasure to welcome you all on this very happy occasion at this place in this country to witness, acknowledge and support Lisa and Callum's commitment to share their lives together. Callum and Lisa are incredibly grateful and honored that you chose to share with them this day. We finally, finally, finally made it. I can't believe it and I can't believe we're here. Seeing you all in this garden that me and Lisa have been to twice already. We've been waiting for this moment for so long. So thank you all for coming. The reason Italy was because 1,354 days ago, not too far from here, I got down on one knee and asked Lisa to make me the luckiest man in the world and marry me. After some convincing, she said yes. It's been two postponements and finally today, I got to see my beautiful wife walk down the aisle in her beautiful dress, something I've been waiting for for a very long time. When I was writing about Lisa and all the things I admire about her, I also came up with a disorganized list of random observations, which I would like to share with you. For example, before she starts a book, she will read the last page first. Really weird, I don't know. For anyone that know, has ever heard Lisa sneeze, they are deafening. She loves to ask a question with an obvious answer. For instance, she asks what a male goddess is called. She'll always fall asleep five minutes to any movie. And in the middle of the night, this has been mentioned, but in the middle of the night, she'll wake up claiming there's something in our room. It could be a floating head. It could be a chicken under the bed. You just don't really know. I don't understand all of your quirks but I don't think I could live without them. In fact, I know I couldn't live without them. There's a quote from Lisa's favorite film that I'd like to read out. Sometimes all you need is 20 seconds of insane courage. Just literally 20 seconds of just embarrassing bravery. And I promise you something great will come of it. Those 20 seconds for me were our first kiss at Warm Cricket Club. <laughs> the first time I said I love you and getting down on one knee and asking you to be my wife. Each of those 20 seconds, something great has come of it. And that has been you. I love you always. I always have, always will. So to my wife, yeah. It's gonna look so cheesy on the video. <laughs> <laughs> 